host Mike Cavanaugh with GayLifeNYC.org and HIVHero.org. And here we are at the Center Dinner Gala. And I can't wait to talk to all the amazing celebrities that are going to be here supporting the amazing things the Center does. I'm so excited. How are you? Well, I'm very well, thank you. <laughs> Welcome to the Center Dinner. And why are you here? Why is it so important to you? Well, because I'm here to honor my dear, dear friend uh, who is right here. And uh, he's uh, Tom Curtehy, who we're honoring tonight with a special special he's absolutely amazing we're so proud that you're here and supporting this center and we're for newly diagnosed people with hiv do you have any message out there about being safe i know you probably lost a lot of friends to the aids epidemic oh my god i certainly have one can never just be too safe one has to be aware one can never take anything for granted one can never assume that you're safe you know you just have to take the necessary precautions and you'd be crazy if you didn't Unless you didn't care. And we do all care, don't we? Well, thank you so much. And you are amazing. We love you and everything you do. Keep going. Thank you so much for being here and supporting the center. You are the most lovely woman I've ever met. Oh, I wish that were true. But thank you for saying it anyway. Okay. Congratulations. <laughs> this is Mike Kavanaugh with GayLifeNYC.org. And I'm with Alan Cumming. How are you? Good. How are you? I heard you're going to do the auctioning tonight. Yes, I'm going to help the auctioneer. Well, I bet that's exciting. Do you have any experience doing that? I have done it before. I have done, like, I mean, I'm basically there to sort of cajole and shame uh, the public into, into giving more money for bids. So I have done that a little bit before. Right. Well, I bet you're going to be fantastic. I'm a huge fan. Thank you so much for supporting the center. Why is this so important to you? Oh, well, the center is such an amazing um, resource for not just for our community but for everyone who's got anything to do with our community and i think it's a kind of a focal point it's very it's a sort of a symbol as well uh, when it's healthy and buzzing and you know at the forefront of uh lots of different programs and lots of different entertainment then that means our whole community is is buzzing and uh and also i'm here tonight because tom uh Kudahi is being honored and i really like him and he's been a great great uh supporter for a long time you know i just come out to help my, my tribe. Well, that's awesome. He's great. We're so glad that you're here. And again, we're a site for newly diagnosed people with HIV. Any message out there about being safe? Well, it's, it's the must thing to do. I mean, keep being safe no matter your status, your, your HIV status. But also, I think, you know, what I found is that young people just haven't got, oops, I'm so sorry. Young people haven't got the message. They haven't been educated in the same way. I think people from my generation and from where I'm, you know, my country, were educated. So I think that it's our duty as older gay men, and especially older, if you're positive, I think, you know, that's more of a spur, perhaps, to make sure that the people coming out, the young people, get out of my way, how dare you? <laughs> I'm trying to do an interview here. Um, uh, it's more of a reason, uh, there's always a, a good reason to, to make sure people are safe, but to keep t talking to younger gay men, and, and not just gay men, you know, straight people are a bit stupid as well about this issue. I agree, and we, our slogan is condoms are hot. Don't you think condoms are hot? Smoking. They're smoking, so be safe, keep your partners protected. Thank you so much, Alan. Thank you so much for being here. You're welcome, thank you. I am with Tom Curtis. Hey, how are you? I'm great. Welcome to the gala, and you are the awardee today. How do you feel? I, I, I feel fantastic. It's such a great cause. All of my friends and family are here. It's a, it's a thrilling evening. It's a great night for the center. I couldn't be happier. Well, you're a Broadway producer. You're on the board. You do so much for the community. Tell me why this, this organization is so important to you. Well, I'm going to talk about that a little bit tonight, but I think the center represents home for the community. And it, with all of the changes that we've experienced in the, the last 25 years, from battling a health crisis to fighting for marriage rights, the center remains as a constant in our lives. It's a safe space for everybody. It's the center of our community, and I, I, I couldn't be more proud to be a part of the board. We are so happy that you're here and getting this award. And I have to tell you that I've been the, to the center many, many times. They've helped me. It's an amazing thing, and I am so surprised to hear that so many people have never visited the center. So please check it out, and thank you. Congratulations on your award. Thank you so much. Thank you. I am with U.S. Representative Barney Frank. How are you from Massachusetts? I'm doing very well. It's a great event, so I'm very happy to be here. Thank you so much. And why is this event so important to you? Well, one, the center has played a very important role. I've been working on the effort to ban discrimination, 
get fair treatment for LGBT people for a long time. The center is one of our most important institutions. And secondly, I'm a great fan and friend of Tom and Terrence. I think uh, what they've done on behalf of the community as well as culture in general in America is great. Well, we're so glad that you're here. Thank you so much for supporting this amazing event. And here's to Massachusetts. We love that state. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm here with Glenda Testone, who is the executive director of the center. How are you tonight? I'm good. How are you doing? I'm doing fantastic. And you look absolutely ravishing as usual. Thank you. Thank you. So congratulations on this amazing event. And we love the center. Like I said, please go to the center. There's so many things. They've helped me. They've helped so many people living with HIV, as well as many other things. So tell us what's new at the center. What's coming up? Oh, there's a lot going on. We've got some cultural programs in April and May. We're going to be tackling LGBT issues and immigration and LGBT issues and race. So it should be very interesting discussions. We've got a women's art exhibit right now going up at the center. So that's something to check out for all the women in the audience. That's awesome. And please go check out everything in the center. They have so many great things. Congratulations on this amazing event. And we, so we're much. so happy to be here. Thank, Thank you. Thank you for coming. Thank you.